Hello, my name's Kate Toon and in this little video, I'm going to give you some tips on how to find the questions your customers are asking about your business and how to use those questions to your advantage by helping you win featured answers in the Google search results, getting that all important position zero. So when it comes to getting featured snippets and position zero in the search engine results, one of the ways we can do this is to focus on the questions that people are asking about our industry or our business. So for example, if you head to Google, let me show you a little example and type, how much do copywriters charge? You'll see that I have the featured snippet for Kate Toon Copywriter. And it's a beautiful big snippet, look, with lots of pictures, an ad for my Clever Copywriting School, a video, and I've also got some content there. And so hopefully I'm gonna get the click through for that featured position. I luckily also, I think, have the uh, second position and the third position as well. So I'm kind of winning on that one. And even though I made a typo in my question, Google was still able to connect the dots. Thank you, Google. So how do you know what questions people are asking? Well, one way is you can just go to Google and start typing in questions like, what should I charge for a blog post? And you can see as I was typing that in, Google started to give me alternative answers there. Let's try again. What should I charge for? There we go. One of my favorites is, Let's see if this works. How to convert to uh, Islam PDF. Love it. Uh, the two top choices. The other thing you can do is once you've typed in your question, you'll see that other questions come up here. People's, people also ask. And as you kind of go down the page and expand these, you'll get more and more questions. And you might think, well, look, they already have someone answering that question. But often it's not the best question that gets pop there, it's just all that Google has. So if you can write something better, then you're gonna maybe nab that featured position, get that top spot, position zero. You can also, of course, as well, scroll down to the bottom and look at other related questions that pop up here. But there is a tool that will help you do this too. So if I go to uh, this tool, it's called Answer the Public, and I type in uh, copywriting rates, the little moody man, he used to be a lot cooler, now he's a bit creepy, will look down and give me some answers. Now this used to be a completely free, free tool, um, now it's, uh, you know, it's premium or freemium, so you get some data but not everything. Um, and it will bring, bring down here, it's gathering the data and it's coming down and talking about where, which, who, what, why, not particularly helpful for these ones. But here we're starting to get copywriting rates for websites, copywriting rates in Canada. Copywriting rates per project, copywriting rates per thousand words. So these are all giving us ideas of things that we could ask. Um, and if you want to get that extra information, uh, then you can. Here we've got some comparison. Copywriting rates versus this versus that. So that's going to be good for those comparison style search intent searches. So it's a pretty blunt tool. We don't get a lot out of it unless we're willing to pay, but it might spark some ideas. But honestly, I think the best ideas come from looking at Google itself, seeing what other people have answered. Can you provide a better answer? Can you give better snippet bait, that 50-ish word answer that makes Google pick your answer over somebody else's and hopefully guarantees a click through to your website as well. So I hope that helped how to nab some featured snippets, how to think of questions and a lifty little tool to help you with all of it. Thanks for watching.